How's it going everyone? It's Sourcing Rob back with an all new video and I know I haven't been uploading videos uh, for some time because I've been sick and I even got a problem in my own mouth so it's it's a bit of a problem for me speaking but today I'm coming up with another video that uh, I still see people facing problems like they cannot connect to Epic Games Launcher and they cannot, are not able to launch it and there are a lot more problems to coming ahead like WR001 error and a lot more like that but probably I think this would probably work for some people and for some people it might won't but nothing goes like that so make sure that you like and subscribe with that getting said let's get started so the first of all thing you need to do uh, let me remind you for that this works on all of the operating systems that are available or are rendered by windows or something like that the first thing that you want to do is to open up control panel in Windows 7 you can simply click on the start button and then go straight to the control panel here for Windows 8.1 users you can right click and even open control panel from the start button and for Windows 10 users or whatever you like uh, if control panel is not available for you right, right, right here or somewhere just you can simply type it from here and type in control panel once you're here, uh, there are two ways you can go into it, and the one I want to do here is to come up here and type in firewall. So you're gonna see Windows Defender firewall, and once you are here, you need to click on Advanced Settings, and now you're gonna be coming up with this Windows Defender firewall with advanced settings on local computers. Now this was uh, given by one of my subscriber. I don't know what his name is, but I think it's something from C but I uh, think uh, it might be popping up on your screen and thanks a lot for that bro I literally show that and the next thing you want to do is to once you're in the firewall just click on inbound rules and from here click on new rule and now you can click on port next now there are three ports you need to enter the very first is gonna be 5222 now make sure it's TCP because we're not connecting to Epic Games Launcher through UDP and let's make a comma and the next two ports are easy to remember because they're given down below here just type in 443 comma and 80 and click next and make sure that you allow the connection coming up next make sure that it's allowed on domain private and public next and right here you can type in unreal engine 4 or epic game sponsor with egl something like that and click finish and that is going to give up with a new rule. You can even go and apply the outbound rule, but I don't prefer that. So I hope this video would have worked for you. If it doesn't, uh, you can even try out turning firewall off for a while and then trying it out. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure that you like and subscribe and comment down below if it didn't work for you. What are the next problems that you're facing? I'm Sarsin Rawat or Frosty signing out.